These are the first minutes after the crash of the Polish president's aircraft in the Smolensk region. The eyewitness who shot this video works in the vicinity. He is used to the sound of the aircraft, which is why he reacted quickly when he heard this. The president's Topolov Tu-154 made an unusual sound as it approached. The aircraft was coming into land. They say it made four approaches. But I didn't see that. I only saw the last one. It made a strange sound. Aircraft land frequently here, and we are used to the sound. This aircraft was landing with an interrupted sound, some loud slaps. The aircraft crashed about 500 meters from the landing strip. You can see how it was descending from the skim trees. The trees were cut at about three meters. Then the aircraft started ascending and crashed into bigger trees. The first version started coming in immediately after the crash. One of the versions was that the cause was due to thick fog. Igor Fomin, an eyewitness, disagrees. When I was driving to work at about 9 o'clock, the fog wasn't so thick. At 11, when the aircraft crashed, there was almost no fog at all. Another version was that the Tu-154 deviated from the trajectory. The flight control officers notified the aircraft's crew about this, but the pilots ignored the instructions. The first flowers at the crash site were bought by local residents only a few hours after the accident. Poland announced a week of national mourning over the tragedy. April 12th was declared a day of mourning in Russia.